Hey fitness fans, Andre Brixton here at Paul the Lens WBFF. That stands for the World Body Fitness Federation. This is the World Championships right here in Toronto, Canada. Now, these two lovely ladies that you see next to me are competing in the exact same category. Let's see if I can get a little bit of dirt on them. So, beginning with you, please introduce yourself. My name is Crystal Bernard. I'm a WBFF Nice. Oh, nice, nice. So we got two pros going up against each other, same category. So let me see if I can get a little bit of controversy started, okay? Crystal, you think you can be joined? I'd feel good if I could. Yeah, I did. Oh. I think Crystal could beat you. <laughs> I don't know. Sure or not, but I would say probably yes. But you know what? Never know. It's all up to the <laughs> Okay, that's enough trouble. We're, we're so nice, eh? Yeah, we're, we're like, not giving you what you want. But we're both okay. from the same hometown, too. We <laughs> train with trains the same trainers. <laughs> so I watch her pooping class, so I know what she's all about. I'm like, she's got it going on. So. <laughs> If I lost her, I would not be upset. <laughs> okay, wait a minute. Okay, so you're at the train, the same training class. Yeah. You're in the same category. So obviously you're not showing her everything that you have, and you're obviously not showing her everything that you have. But let's save some of that for the stage, okay? What I want to know right now is what have you done differently from last year when you turned pro to what what package you're bringing on stage this year at the World Championships? <laughs> Um, different this year, I would say I came in late, so I would say cardio, lots of it, lots more, and presentation of it itself. I think you'll have to wait and see. <laughs> okay, I'll be there. And same question for you. What have you done differently from when you won your pro show, your pro show um, in Quebec, and what are you doing differently as you prepare to start? onto the world stage. Well, I had a whole year to prepare, which I think was done there, but I did watch a world stage the first day to see all the girls on stage, and I was like, okay, I have a lot of work to do, but I knew I had to balance out my physique, my short suit has always been my lower half, so the last year I've worked really hard on trying to build my legs, and the glutes too, so it's really good. So, I think I've been bringing a more balanced physique, and more shape to my lower half, so I think that will stand out as a surface. Okay, let's talk a little bit about some of the changes that you made to your lower half and as you put it, your glutes. You know, um, what type of training have you incorporated? Was it was it more sprints? Was it running hills? Was it weights? Was it squats? Um, a lot of squats that always goes into building up your legs, right? But um, definitely a lot of uh, heavy weights, lower reps, and then I did a lot of plyos towards the end of the season to try and get some more cuts. And the step mill, my best friend. I rock that thing every morning. As much as I need it, I just think every step moves, moves, moves. Yeah. <laughs> That's true. That's what runs through my head. And uh, the changes that you've made, as, as previously mentioned, you're coming in leaner, a little more cardio, but you have a secret that you haven't really showed Crystal. Like she said earlier, we have the same trainer, so we kind of the same way, but I would say because of self motivation and just wanting to beat that person who won last year and try to look better than them, so just the cardio for me was the biggest thing. Sticking to the diet. Okay. Achieving nothing. I like that. Now, my final question for both of you, and I'm going to start with you, okay? And that is what is it about the WBFF that made you decide? You know what, this is where I want to compete. This is family and this is where my heart is. Oh, you just said it, the family is, is what I love about it. Everybody's friends here, you know, just love each other, hug each other, and that part is just made me feel like welcoming and um, just the whole the fact that you have been promoting yourself and just, you know, she is making me enjoy this whole show. So it just made it for me. Like that. Same question for you. Actually, can we post again? Did you take care of the show? Okay, and the same question is for you. What is it about the WBF that made you decide, you know, this is where I want to compete, this is home, this is where I want to compete? Well, I started off with IFPG, doing the local shows. And then I 
It's a little bit cheaper, way more economical, and I was like, hey, I'm going to go out of my comfort zone, go travel somewhere, do a show. And I mean, it's, they're not comfortable, right? Um, we all know all the people who are actually at the shows. The shows are amazing. You feel like a superstar. You know, you have great MCs such as yourself. I was a privilege to walk on stage with. And the whole thing is just this kind of superstar attitude. Everyone's so nice. Like my first show, um, Annette Milbert, this is the one I looked up to. And, you know, she came and told me, you're amazing, you look so good. And, like, you know, just everyone's so welcoming. They make you feel like you have the confidence to be able to succeed. not going anywhere either. <laughs> See, that's what we like right here at the WBFF. You, you heard it here first, ladies and gentlemen. It's family. It's what it's all about. It's about promotion, but it's also about promoting yourselves. It's about the talent that you see right here. You know, some of the most beautiful women in the world competing right here at the WBFF. Ladies, I want to wish you both good luck. I want to say congratulations for whichever one of you win. I will not be choosing, but I will be announcing. So. Ladies and gentlemen, thank you so much for tuning in. I'm Andre Brooks St. Clair for the World Body Fitness Federation. We'll see you soon. Thank you. Thank you. You're awesome.